In our last installment, uh, we had glued the fins on and glued the standoff to the launch lug. And all my glue is dry, so I can go ahead and remove my fin alignment jig. And um, our next step is to um, take the launch lug and we're going to glue it onto the tube. And on the tube, you'll see there's an etched line where that launch lug will sit. And it shows where the uh, that diagonal piece is on the back of the launch lug like this. So that will be facing aft. So we'll go ahead and glue this on. It really doesn't matter if you glue it on the other way. Um, it should be fine. You do want to sight down the tube and make sure it's the tube that's the important part, um, that it's nice and straight. Um, and just in case your standoff is glued on uh, crooked. Um, you can test it by, you know, putting your rockets together. Well, you have to put the uh, shoulder in. Um, in fact, well, we'll do that. We'll just, we'll do a test here. It's always good to test. And that has to line up with that. This launch lug has to line up with that one. Uh, so we want to sight down the tube and just make sure that they're, they're uh, nice and straight when you get them both lined up. All right, so um, our next step is step 56, and that's to put on the fin fillets. Um, so this is just like we did before. Just put your bead of glue along. And we're also going to do the launch lug itself. And this one gets two beads of glue, one on the launch lug and one on the tube. And it wasn't dry. <laughs> so this is why you should allow it to dry. So let me go ahead and fit, do these. Just run your finger and take off the excess. Don't forget that little front edge, go around the corner on it. Still not dry. Should probably wait. Don't be in a rush. Make sure that it's still straight. All right, so we'll let that dry and then we'll put the, uh, the fillets on the other side. And again, um, just set it horizontally to dry so that it doesn't run onto your table. Uh, okay. Our next step, we're getting close to the uh, end of the construction part. In fact, this is probably where you will um, lose parts. <laughs> we're going to take the um, transition here. Get my glue bottles again. Um, we're going to take the disc K, this one here is the last cardboard piece. Uh, we're going to drop it into the uh, transition and you want to um, flatten it out and uh, just take some um, thin CA glue 
can go around the perimeter and that will uh, lock it in place and you can take some accelerator insta set and just a little squirt and that will kick it off and make it permanent in there so now it's in there all right so um, I wish that was dry, but we'll wait for that to be dry and put the fillets on and then we'll attach this to that and uh, almost ready to paint. Um, there won't be any um, painting instructions in this series because we have a number of painting videos, but we will come back and install the electronics and show you how to get it prepped for flight. But uh, but before we do that, we'll attach this uh, transition. And uh, so we'll see you in the next video.